All right, another episode of Ace Combat. I think this is mission 16. I'm not too sure. I forgot. I keep forgetting. You know, my memory's not as good as it used to be, so hey, let's just see. Wow, cutscene. All right. Get some popcorn. As far as the chaos we find ourselves in these days, it's difficult to say which side pulled the trigger first. Arugia deployed an automatic intercept system with drones. Osea implemented long-range attacks to bypass them. So Arugia decided to sabotage Osea's communications and navigation technology. Arugia couldn't launch a satellite themselves, but they were still able to hack the software of the Osean transmission and navigation systems. Before Osea even noticed, half of their satellites were hijacked. That's when things got ugly. In an attempt to knock out each other's capabilities, both forces <clears throat> launched fighters loaded with anti-satellite missiles at the same time. Only military satellites were targeted. However, their destruction created a debris field in orbit which wiped out scores of other satellites, both private and government owned. What kept the world relatively sane up to that point had been free-flowing data and information. But now, those were gone. All that remained was chaos and confusion. Government and civilian broadcasts and transmissions were cut off. The flow of information had ceased. Forces on both sides of the conflict now found themselves unable to communicate with their superiors. Many of the smaller countries annexed by Arugia and yearning for their independence seized the opportunity and started their own uprisings. As for why some of Osea's military decided to break off from the main force and continue on their own, I have no idea. Perhaps there was some sort of dispute over the chain of command. The continent that had once seen wars that were only fought between Osea and Rugia was now full of numerous conflicts between rival leaders vying for power. Insurgencies were everywhere. I even heard a rumor that a group of Osean convicts had rebelled. Rumors. It never ceased to amaze me that even at a crazy time like this, something as trivial as a rumor could find its way here. Communications from corporate were cut off. Apparently, the entire computer network was down. It was a wise decision to make our drones autonomous with AI instead of being radio controlled. Wise and forward thinking. Even with their GPS offline, they can still use their sensors to navigate as long as they're working properly. I'm sure the drones are still working perfectly, following their mission orders to the letter. I wish I could upload Mihai's new data to them, but without a connection, I can't upload the software to the active drones. The new ones we're making, though, there should still be enough time to upgrade those before they're activated. I'll be taking the data I've acquired away from the front lines now. Oh, and I'll be taking the girls too. I told my assistant Masa it was time to get Mihai's granddaughters ready to leave here. <coughs> She's not much older than the girls, but she has a way about her, and I'm sure she won't have any trouble with them. <laughs> okay. That's kind of sinister. I eh? saw a plane flying off in the distance. I imagine it was looking for a safer place. The plane had a rose emblem on it. <coughs> Mission number 16. We're getting there. Like four more missions to go. Arusia's communication networks have been down since their satellites were destroyed. Unfortunately, we are experiencing trouble too. All of Yuzia has been affected, and we don't know when things will be back up and running. We're not even sure if this is Arugia's doing. Still, we will follow the strategy that was originally planned, and move on to the next operation after liberating Farbanti. Let's get to it. Since the war began, we've been receiving communications in secret from an officer in the Arusian army. With the capital under our control, Arusia's radical element is losing support quickly, affecting the balance of power. HQ is thinking of using the military officer as a way to gain leverage to settle peace negotiations. 
The officer is currently hiding in the outskirts of Anchorhead Bay, having joined up with support dispatch from the Ocean Army. The plan is that they'll take a standard vehicle to a rendezvous point at a harbor in the east part of the city, where a helicopter will be waiting. I would like the new Strider Squadron to provide escort for the officer. Cyclops will remain at the base on standby to serve as defense. With the communication network currently down in the capital, I very much doubt Arusia will be able to mount a regimented counterattack. However, it is likely that Arusia's intelligence department and the remaining forces who are aware of the officer's movements will interfere. Keep a close eye on the officer and make sure he stays safe. Our victory in Farbanti has given us a golden opportunity to finally end this war. Be safe out there. Take note that our satellite-based IFF has become unreliable following the recent communications failure. As such, target ID will be done by processing the images from the <coughs> infrared cameras on your aircraft. Objects will initially appear as unknown on your HUDs, but will be ID'd once you close in on them for a set period of time. Oh, wow. Okay. Well, that's going to be tough. Okay, I got to go find this guy. All right, well, let me check out the aircraft tree before I start. And uh, I don't have enough cash. I know that. Well, maybe I do. Hold on. No, I don't. <laughs> kind of used up all of my cash there. Oh, well. I can uh, buy these things. Yep. Okay, missile range. Nice. Hmm. Okay, well. Alright. That's all I can get. Nothing else. Okay, let's just start the mission. <clears throat> I will choose my aircraft. I will go with the, uh, I'll go with my F-18. Pretty good. Uh, probably some, uh, let's see, hold on. Some air-to-air -air missiles. Everything's good. Strider Squadron, you're cleared to taxi. <coughs> <clears throat> Sorry about that. Let's do it. Mission 16. Getting close. Like I said, about like four more missions left before the uh, last one, so that's what I heard anyways. Again, this is Ace Combat. Anything can happen. <laughs> you know, they're probably like a 21st mission or something. You never know. But uh, yeah, it's getting good. <laughs> There's not much to talk about, it's loading. I can't wait to fly. There we go, finally. To the unidentified Ocean craft, <coughs> this is Captain Carl of the Ocean Army. Are you here for the escort? You're not the squadron I was expecting. Are you really friendlies? Over. This is Longcaster. Airborne warning and control system for the hey, Ocean nice. Long Range Strategic Strike Group. Captain Carl, they're on our side. And those two pilots we've heard about must be here too. Okay, <coughs> I hope you're right. <coughs> Longcaster, are all of these really unknowns? It's a state of civil war. The Erosian army is fighting itself. There's no guarantee the Oceans won't shoot us in this confusion. We'll image process the unknowns caught in your cams to identify friend or foe. The process will be faster if you get a close-up, well-centered image. Meanwhile, we just run if they shoot us, right? Affirmative. Always identify your target before you fire. Something I'll never get used to, but tonight has been a total shock. The city under martial law, gunfire and the roar of jets echoing through the streets. Give me Strider Squadron's IDs. Oh, and uh, hand me that sandwich.
on your line of sight. Make sure to keep track of your objective. How this war ends depends on this mission. I'm counting on you. All right. Fox two. Strider three launching missile. Strider squadron, identify the unknowns along the route. Oh no, oh no. We have no orders, but we do have ID data. Check your tap terminal. Goodness. Goodness gracious. Great balls of fire. Alright, that's a bad guy. Boop. Dead. Strider 1, target destroyed. I've been spiked. You have? Oh, God. Wish I had some night vision. Ah, come on. Oh, that's an ally. Damn it. Hold on. All right, gonna swing around like this. Give me a chance to uh, get a lock on this thing and see what it is. Okay, that's an ally. Okay, those are allies. An ally, please tell this. Please let this be an ally. The general's vehicle is under attack. Oh no! Vehicle blocking the road. No response to hails. It's the radicals. They're so far. I'm hit. Get this guy off my back. Got him. We have to remain vigilant. Target is in machine gun range. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yes. Boom, baby. Next one. Oh, we got a couple of targets here. I got it, I got it, I got it. Hold on, hold on. Signs of the clean warfare at the beginning 
They're not the ones I'm sure supposed to go after. These guys over here. Trying as bad as possible. Oh wait, are there any more enemies? Oh no! Looks like I got everything. Friendlies.
take a bridge. There'll be nowhere to hide. That was something. Oops, it's all gone to hell. Radio chatters about the Civil War. Radio? You have one in your cockpit? An armored vehicle's behind us. I got it, I got it. Hold on. Alright, I need to turn around. No, that's not what I want. I want the guys behind him. Got it, hold on. So close. I'm going to die. I'm going to die. Not cool. Not cool at all. Boom, baby. Oh my goodness. Almost reached the container area. Watch out for enemy ambushes. Missile. Understood. Missile. Ah, too many missiles. System failures caused by the fire incidents among OCM forces. Well, those are bad guys. They're in the way. Turn around, turn around, turn around. Yeah, gotta go. Uh, uh, this way. There we go. Got him. Ally, I'm an ally. Don't shoot me. Oh no, come on! What the? Strider one is down. Stall warning, really? Come on. Oh, those are bad guys. Well, yeah, don't they don't know where we're safe? Tank. We're taking fire. Take care of them. We're taking fire. We can't hold off. 
I got him. You're all good guys, right? You're all good guys. I don't know if that was a good guy or a bad guy. Take out that tank. One more tank. That's it. This one's all mine. Fox 2. We're taking heavy fire. Concentrate your fire on the combat. Vehicle. I just did. Don't worry about it. I couldn't have asked for a better time. Nice. Let it be the radicals. How's your last long caster? Allies, allies. Good stuff. <laughs> Let's go, Captain Carl. Not lying. 
thing about carrying civilians. No, unless she's a soldier. That's where they are. They're Russian fighters. What the hell's going on? Stay sharp. Uh huh. Right. I'm shooting them down. Any complaints? Granted. All right. Welcome. Time Welcome. to kick some butt. Coming for you. Mine. Couple more missiles. Boom, baby. Good work. All hostile aircraft eliminated. The liaison is safe. Wait. The escort fighter is. The drive. They're missing the drive. What the hell? You gotta be kidding me. Liaison escort has a radar lock. They're targeting you guys. What the hell? We were just helping them. Aircraft. This is AWACS Longcaster. Do not engage the liaison. Break off now. Can you hear me on this channel, OC Craft? Those escort aircraft are drones. They are currently being operated autonomously. They are not being controlled by anyone. They are flying on their own volition. What? In that case, we have no choice but to shoot the aircraft down. Unfortunately, yes. We did what we could. Weapons free. We're cleared to attack the escort. <laughs> Weapons free, baby. Weapons free. Time to kick some ass. Boom, baby. Next one. Oh, 
Are you kidding me? No, you don't. Not a target. That is not a target. Warning, enemy has a beat on you. Five bandits remaining. Damn it. I don't have the drive they need. Good stuff. Ooh, that was a tough battle. Understood. <laughs> All hostiles have been eliminated. Nice. The general's helicopter is flying safely outside Anchorhead Bay. All aircraft, RTB, mission complete. Return to base. All hostiles. Flare, flare, flare. <laughs> some thumbnails here and uh, some good stuff there you know shooting off yep ooh look at that <laughs> oh wow man that was a exhausting mission about 40 minutes I'm tired. <laughs> need to need to stop soon. Ooh. But it was really cool though. I like that mission. Trying to determine who's the uh, enemy and who's not. That's pretty cool mechanic. I like that. <laughs> All right, let's see. Whoa. In order to respond to the attack on the base, Cyclops has scrambled after being on standby. We'll head up too once our planes are ready. Oh, and Labarth is dead. What did you say? Apparently, he was shot down by another Ocean aircraft after he left the area of operations. I mean, I know it was chaos, but still. At any rate, the sealed order operation has come to a close. We have no idea about a plan for going forward. All we can do for now is watch our own backs. What's up with the commander? He's staying in his room. He's still alive, since we can hear him crying. Okay. That sucks. But there you go. Mission 16. Wow. What a nice, long mission. But it's uh, way over the limit. So I better stop this thing now. And I'll catch you guys later.